Welcome to Miami Misadventures, Episode 1. These mods will serve as a uh, showcase of sorts for content that's made during the production of Fallout Miami. Oops, here we go. Wild Goose Chase. Let's tune in. If you're wandering the Commonwealth and listening to this, then I've got an opportunity you won't want to miss. There ain't no drop off them. Just the chance to get your hands on some mighty fine loot. If you're willing to scuffle. The name's Fontaine, and I was on my way to set up shop in your neck of the woods like and Hank offer y'all some King mighty of fine goods. But some mask wearing thugs decided they wanted a full discount. Now, it's known that folks north of the Mason Dixon ain't exactly civilized, and robbing a man in broad daylight is par for the course, but beating him to an inch of his life? That is just plain ugly. That is a no-no. Now, I don't care for my stuff bag. Find us keepers in the wasteland, far as I'm concerned. But that kind of behavior should not go unpunished. And I don't want the custom equipment I was carrying in the hands of bandits, either. If you go after those kids, just be careful. They are animals. I'm fixing to come back north and set up shop later on. Can't say when, but I'll let y'all know. Till then, if you want to augment your arsenal... And teach some thugs a lesson. Listen up. They ambushed me on a road just outside Jamaica Plain. Didn't even have the common courtesy to say it was a stick-up. Ain't been too long since, so I reckon you can pick up their trail there and track them down. Give them what they deserve. Happy hunting. This has been a pre-recorded message. Message repeats in three seconds. All right, we've got our marching orders, guys. Let's head out. Okie dokie. This doesn't look good. Oop. There's a body. Uh, I guess it's smokers. Shorten your lifespan, dudes. Oh, gotta get my Brahmin meat for some Brahmin burgers. Anything else kicking around here? Oh, there's another dude. Oh, there's a mask. Benji's note. Stim pack. Bunny mask. Let's read Benji's note. Alright, let's go. Uh, eating good tonight. Shane Bowen Holland went and beat his bodyguard dead. He seemed like a swell guy, but them's the breaks. Wasn't safe to keep the loot here, though. I stayed behind to pick the camp. Clean? In case we miss something. Jamil and the others dragged the good stuff back to our place in the high road behind the crescent moon. Good thing it's easy to see from the military checkpoint. Alright, so Benji's note tells us that it's by a military checkpoint. And uh, we're looking for uh, the high road behind the crescent, crescent moon. Oh man, I don't play golf, so I don't need the golf club, but I will take the crocodile statue. Okay, I think that's all that's all it is for us here. So we're looking for a checkpoint. Maybe the South Boston military checkpoint. Let's check out this bunny mask here. This looks like something under the shining. Very happy though. Nice. Alright, let's uh let's take a look at the map. South Boston Military Checkpoint. Alright, so we found a few things in the Miami Misadventures mod so far. We're still looking for a submachine gun, but we found a golf club, some animal masks, the crocodile statue, um, custom letterman's jacket and jeans. Let's keep an eye out for that. Oh, there's a crescent. There's a crescent moon behind on that lady's face. And that's the high road, obviously. And that's up really high. Okay. And going up. Let's see what we can see. And top floor, hardware. Ladies' lingerie. Alrighty. 
Oh boy, this isn't good. Well, let's shut this off before I get a copyright strike for something dumb. Jamila, that's terrible. So stash photo. Well, this is a picture of staff stash someplace. It's helpful. She's got a note. And a, oops, sorry about that. She's okay. She's not faking. Sometimes, sometimes they do that. Let's skip this note here. Holland and Bo have been pretty on edge lately. I'll stop running with them, probably. Crazy Bosco. There was one custom gun that's probably worth more than the rest. That's what I'm after. Hit a safe nearby and took a picture so we could find it later. Bo went out somewhere and Holland's just sitting there giving me the creeps. I'll give her the slip and meet you by. And that's when she got shot in the face. Sorry, Jamila. It's a nice zebra mask there. Lovely zebra mask. Sleepwalker's note. Drop is the only thing that bothers me. You know, we get at nights. Well, if you sleepwalk, probably, probably up on the uh, overpass, it's probably a bad idea. But I will help myself to your caps. And this jet. And the stuff in the safe. Got it. Some ammo. Bottle caps. Sure, let's take it all. Oh. Alright. I guess we can't take it all. Hold on while I dump something stupid. Let's see. That's pretty heavy. Yeah, let's get rid of this. See you later. Maybe we can move again. Huh. They have a little playhouse for hitchhikers too, like I do. Their rebar door is much nicer, though. That's it. <laughs> Any explosives? No. Probably a bad idea to keep with people you're trying to keep prisoner. Hmm. Yeah, that is a long drop. Alright, let's take a look at that photo again. Looks good. Hmm. Okay, let's buy a car and a building. In a fence. I did walk off to the east during the <laughs> cut content. <laughs> it went poorly. There's a bunch of hopefully unaffiliated raiders there. Uh, and and uh, a few rust devils and a bunch of killer robots. So now we're going west of the road. Hoping, <laughs> hoping, hoping against hope I don't have to go back east. Because there are mucho unfriendlies down there. Everything seems pretty quiet. Oh, Bert! Man, you get around, buddy. I wish I could just lay around on a pallet all day catching the sun, but... I've got a mystery to solve and shit to find. Hey. Oh. Did you hear that? Ah, it's Bo! Alright, we're gonna take care of these jack wagons. Right quick. We're just gonna nuke or grenade him. Shit's got ambush. <laughs> Shoot them all. It's just me. <laughs> <laughs> ah. I love it when a plan comes together. Oh, geez, Bo looks like crap. Stim pack. Tiger mask. Letterman's jacket. Let's get a look at this. Hold on. Come on, tough guy. Come on. What has he got there? What is that? The manatees? Oh 
man, that's pretty cool. Oh, shit. Ah! <laughs> I got him as a meat shield. Hold on, Holland. You're not gonna shoot old Bo here. Look, I'm spinning him around with nothing but the power of my mind. You're dead. You're you can me. strike me down, but I'll become more powerful than you could possibly imagine. Oh, shit, I can't aim through him. Bo, you're more of a hindrance than a help, buddy. I'm gonna tell you. Ah, crap. At least I can drop him. Alright. I should've worn armor. Instead of, like, just a shirt. Let's get the stash thing open. That's it. Wild goose. Oh, look at this. This looks fun. <laughs> yes, please. All right, let's test this out on old Holland, huh? Oh, hold on, Holland. Let me switch it up. Wild goose. Talk to me, goose. We only have a 152 rounds of this 10 millimeter here. Let's light her up. <laughs> Nice. What does she got? She got like a cool letterman's jacket too? She got a wolf mask. A greaser jacket and jeans. Do I want that? And what did he have? Yeah, he had a letterman's jacket. The manatees. I may strut around wearing that. Can I get a look at the back again? Let me take a look at this. Letterman's jacket. It should be like a t-shirt. Oh, it just says M. Yeah, it's all folded up. Okay. We'll have to model that at some point. Well, what does that say? Live live the dream. Dude, I tell you, I am living the dream. Nice, it's suppressed. Let's take a look at the tiger mask. The wolf mask. That's pretty cool. The zebra mask. Let's put on that tiger mask. Get a look at this. Ah, oh, crap. Hold on. Let me move in the sun. Nope. Still in the shadows. There we go. That does look bad. I clip it through my helmet a little bit, but that's okay. Probably not meant to wear both at the same time. Okay, so this is Wild Child. This is what we've been sent to really... Not sent, but... This is what we've been uh, after. I don't, I don't really want a greaser jacket and jeans. Those are pretty common, I think. Now that we've got Wild Child... Let's, uh... Let's take it on back to the weapons bench. And check it out. Alright, we've got the Wild Goose back to the workbench here. Let's take a look at the modifications we can do. Uh, multiple... <laughs> Wow, there's a whole bunch of uh, receivers you can choose from. As far as barrel goes, we got short, short, light, long, and uh, long light. Stock options, I have a short stock, full stock, and the recoil compensating stock. Magazines, we have a standard and quick eject versions. Glow sights. Uh, we have glow sights installed. There are iron sights, and the other option is a short recon scope. We go no muzzle, a large bayonet. Uh, we can have a compensator, muzzle brake, or it comes with the suppressor. And the materials. Oh, these look like faction paints. Okay. Wild Goose. Brotherhood of Steel. Ooh, the Enclave. That looks pretty cool. Uh, the Institute, the Minutemen, I like the wood, Nuclear Patriots, the Railroad, and that's it. Boy, these are all, these are all pretty good. I like the Minutemen, the Enclave, the Railroad, but you know, I do like Wild Goose. And, uh, that's it for, uh, modifications. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.